If you live in France or if you are a solopreneur, you've probably heard about folk CRM in numerous LinkedIn posts. But is it that good? At Break Call, we got many customers coming from Folk to Break Call. And if we fare with them, we also got some customers going from Break Call to Folk. In this video, I will share my opinion about Folk CRM, but also the feedback I got from prospects and customers who were using Folk CRM in the past. So, Folk is a CRM software initiated by Thibaut Elzier, who sold his startup Fotolia to Adobe for more than 700 millions of dollars. He's the Franco-Belgium guy behind the startup studio eFounders who created Erco, Spendesk and many other successful startups in Europe. Folk, although it started in 2017-2018, actually was an in-house project of eFounders for years and probably the project Thibaut cared the most about because he was the CEO of Folk at some point. So if you follow the dates, Folk pretty much started as the same time as Atio, another leading VC-backed CRM software. On one hand, Hatio went straight away for big organizations while Folk decided to become the no-code CRM, kind of a mix between Notion and CRM itself. And that's pretty much the feeling I get when I talk with people. Folk to them is like if Notion was solely a CRM software. So it's super customizable, very well burst, and UI UX is frankly stellar. The ease of use is probably the best thing about Folk. You can also manage the software from LinkedIn, X, and many other platforms. However, Folk is not a sales focused CRM. So you won't have integrations with most sales tools on the market, and you won't be able to build complex workflows flows to automate your CRM like it will be possible on HubSpot or Pipedrive or Atio or even Breakall to be fair. Folk in a sense is pretty much the perfect CRM if you're looking for smart automations that you don't need to set up. For example, reminding you to follow up your contacts without you having to think about it, which is pretty cool. So with that being said, how break call is different from Folk? Because this is a question we get a lot. Long story short, break call is an AI sales focused CRM meaning that we have plenty sales tools integrations for you to build sales workflows where your CRM is pretty much the heart of it and you don't need to think about the hassle of building workflows with Zapier, Make or N8N. Another difference is that in Breakcall, you can natively interact with your leads on socials, for example, with LinkedIn, which is a big thing uh, at Breakcall, but also with Telegram and WhatsApp. And by the way, on WhatsApp, it's pretty interesting because Folk has recently added it to the CRM as well. Then we can talk about AI note takers or AI features in general. Uh, for example, on break call, you can auto sync your text and video transcript, but also create tasks out of it. Overall, in this space, I usually say the following to prospects. Break call is kind of the new pipe drive. So the modern AI sales CRM for digital SMBs. Atio is kind of the new Salesforce or HubSpot. So the modern AI CRM for PLG startups and big organizations. And Folk is more closer to a specialized Notion CRM on steroids. So the modern AI CRM for solopreneurs and small teams. All three softwares have their strengths and weaknesses. So make sure to try all three before making up your mind. There's no like right or wrong answer. You really have to try it and find Find out what is the best for you. If you like this video, make sure to like, subscribe to that YouTube channel, and to try out my AI sales CRM software at breakhole.com. Peace, bye.